Okay, here's my Rolling Stones vinyl collection. There's about maybe 16 records and one import 45. So here we go, all in a very good condition. Now, sticky fingers, if you have the import of this, check the zipper. The actual zipper on it. I had two copies of this. This one, the domestic one, which the albums, you know, the, the vinyl's really good condition. The import one, it was trashed. It was, you know, pretty badly warped. But I knew the cover was decent. So I, I was looking into selling it, and long story short, found out if you have the import, if it has star, S-T-A-R, written down the zipper, you have something. I sold mine for a hundred bucks, just the cover, and it had a little ring wear to it. I mean, it wasn't in great condition. Out of ten, I'd say it was maybe a six, and still got a hundred bucks for it. So if you have the import of Sticky Fingers, you might want to check it, because it, it's worth some money for whatever reason. Course hot rocks. Let it bleed. Another incredible album. Aftermath, probably Stupid Girl is probably my favorite one on that one. Made in the Shade, great compilation. This is the first. Rolling Stone record I ever had. Black and Blue, introducing Ron Wood. And Love You Live is their, by far their best live album. And Some Girls with the Uncensored cover. And 12 Inch of Miss You, Extended. Emotional Rescue. It doesn't have the poster in it, but, you know, very good condition. I got it for like four bucks. And then Tattoo Used by, that's my favorite album. I mean, Slave's awesome. Tops, just the whole album from beginning to end is very good. And the live album from that tour. Undercover. Has the stickers on it and 12 inch extended version of Undercover of the Night. So there's the 12 inches. Then I have this 45 import, and I'm just a plain cover, but it's the 45 of Anybody Seen My Baby, and it doesn't have a label on it. It's just pressed into the vinyl itself. Side. Same thing, just pressed in, and it has a different version of it. So that's pretty cool to have. But there you go, there's my Rolling Stones vinyl collection.